Oh, shit. What time is it? It's time for the Royal Goose. Hi, welcome back to the Royal Goose. We're gonna continue the game. We were just talking about YouTube stiff. Yeah. <laughs> you know, what we were talking about in the last episode. Hey. Oh, thank you, Elliot. Thank you. <laughs> I did it. Hey, did you ever see that? Want to hear something completely off subject? No. I, I recently... What's with this graphics? I listened to this, um... You know, um... You know Vladimir Putin? No. He, um... Vladimir Putin? Yeah. Who's that? <laughs> you fucker. What? What is? I I know his name. What is? He's he's the president, president of Russia. Of Russia. Yeah. Okay. I I had a feeling. So he some James. I I got James to believe me. I could only hold the straight face for so long though. Only for like half a second. No, until more like I realized, five seconds. Mm -hmm. Five seconds. Yeah, your face. <laughs> your face. Yeah. Um. He's like a little turtle. Look at him. Rodent, he's so cute. Yeah. Um, so you know how in Russia there's a lot of anti-gay laws and bullshit like that? Yeah. Somebody took a video. Very homophobic culture. Yeah, which is very, you know, which is very bad. Yeah. Um, uh, somebody took a, a video of Vladimir Putin, of him, like, addressing the nation on something, and he made it so... I want everybody to know that I am gay, gay, gay. I like long, big cocks. I'm a super, super gay. I like long, <laughs> big cocks. Again, I want you to understand. <laughs> I am gay, gay, gay. I like long, big cocks. That's good. <laughs> and they have like Psy from yeah. Open Cotton of Style up here in the background. And it's just rainbow color. <laughs> That's pretty good. I listened to that remix like for five minutes <laughs> while I was like doing dishes and making yeah. dinner. <laughs> I love that yeah. video. That's pretty good. Yeah, dude, it's glorious. It's glorious. It's glamorous. Now let, let's go into a 10 minute long discussion on, you know, the anti-gay laws in Russia, because I know people love political discussions like that. How about gun laws? Yeah, yeah, let's talk about gun laws okay. instead. So, well... yeah, yeah, no, how about not? <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, Just by saying that... If this were ever famous, if this were ever popular, if we video, ever monetized, no, if we ever got enough subscribers, I bet you the comment section would just be like fucking <laughs> trash, just flame wars, flame, yeah. flame, 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 just you fire everywhere. You goddamn idiots who think guns should be legal are stupid. We should. You stupid idiots who want to ban guns are stupid. Guns should not exist. We should give all three-year-olds guns. Yeah. Yeah. It might. My one-year-old child owns a gun. I'll let my... Fucking whim. I'll let my one-year-old child shoot my Mosin the Gump before he eats goddamn breakfast. <laughs> hey, you know, actually, decent segue. I, do you... Like, what are your favorite shooting games, Elliot? Oh. Do you have any favorites? Yeah. Um... I mean, this one's probably my single favorite. Single player or, like, competitive? Uh, competitive. anything, really. Okay, I probably have, like, a list. Let me come up with a list. Nostalgic. I'll try and give you five different... Five different types of games. Nostalgic, most nostalgic. Back in the day, All right. was Goldeneye. Ah, that's a common. That's a very common. Fucking awesome. But as today goes, no way. Fuck that game. I'm. I'm just gonna say right now, I completely agree with you. I bar. I borrowed that game from a friend back in college, yep. and I was like, everybody it's praises ass. this game like it's the best. It's I, like, so bad now. I'm sure it's outdated, but still, I want to see what it's like. It's I tried so playing bad it. Now. Oh, yes, holy shit. Did you shit. never play it when it was popular? No, dude, I never oh, did. Oh, it was awesome. My like, friend owned it, but we never played it. We played at, Smash. Mm, at the time, oh, Smash was fantastic. Oh, yeah, Smash is. Uh, holds but yeah, up dude, fucking. 007 at the time was awesome. Like, yeah, it was revolutionary. So amazing. Like, the graphics were good. Mm -hmm. And it felt smooth, but now it's just like, oh my god, this is so bad. Um, yeah, like Halo came out, like, what, five years later? That kind of revolutionized, and I think Halo was one of one of the first games, at least on console, to, like, really standardize the control scheme. With the two sticks. Yep. I see. And, and that was good. But, uh, right, so I really like... Golden is number one. My favorite competitive shooter game is CSGO probably. Ah, uh, Counter-Strike really like Go. Counter-Strike Global Offensive. Uh, it's fun. I used to hate that game. Really? I, I got it. I was in early, early, early beta because long story short, I have a Steam account that gets... Dude, somebody fucking shot a bullet through your TV. Oh, shit. And they cracked the top. Oh, my God. What are you going to do about it? And all the viewers, too. Oh, jeez. 
Oh, God. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I got that game because I have a special Steam account, and I get all the Valve games. Ah, uh, okay. Although they haven't come out with many games lately, but I get them for free. Cute. Yeah. Uh, so I was, like, in super early beta in CSGO, and I fucking hated it. Um, oh, I just I wasn't used to it, you know? Uh... But anyways, I love CSGO. I'll play it and not play it for a while, but off and on, I usually come back. Mm. My favorite arcade-style kind of shooter uh, is Call of Duty. Uh, probably arcade. Black Ops. Black Ops. Yeah, I mean, it's it's not very realistic. Like, you get shot in Call of Duty, well, that's fine. You can get shot, like, five times before you die. You run around the map, and you have, like, fucking drone missiles. You know what I mean? Hmm, Arcade, okay. in a sense, it's not very realistic. Okay. It's just, it's just fun. I like Black Ops the most, I think. Okay. Um, let's see. God, I fucking hate this part. This part's really hard. Most popular, uh, like, new shooter game is PUBG. PUBG, yeah, okay. Yeah. What does player, that stand for again? Player Unknown Battleground. It's very fun. Is, it's, it, is it a PC game? Yes. And it's now on Xbox One, but I hear the Xbox One version is dog shit. Oh, that's Just because it's optimized bad. And, but okay. it's basically, uh, you can play by yourself on a team of two or in teams of four. And if you really want to, you can play as a team of three with other teams of four. So, damn it, motherfucker. It's one to four players. Okay. And... It's basically like the Hunger Games, kind of. Sweet. Ah. So every match you start over, you have no guns or anything. Everyone starts in a plane. And the plane flies across the map, and you jump out and parachute where you want to land, and you collect the guns and ammo, and then you try to be the last person alive. Okay. And the map will basically shrink over time. There's like... Uh, Dude, check this shit out. <laughs> I died, but the door's already open. Woo! <laughs> Continue, please. Yeah, uh, there's like an electric field that comes in, so it pushes uh, players to like come in, or else I like die. that, dude. Yeah, so That's cool. because if the hu the whole map was open the whole time, you'd never see anyone. Mm -hmm. right? Like, uh, so it's very fun. And then uh, let's see, favorite first person like uh, adventure shooter. You know, but before you say that, um, adventure I am. Oh, okay then. Um, I was gonna say, uh, so if you loved Goldeneye back in the day, what yeah. about Perfect Dark? I didn't play it. Oh, okay. Because yeah. a lot of... Cause it's whenever, very similar, right? Well, yeah, like, it, it's made by the same team. Yep. And it's basically, like, like, people say, like, Perfect Dark is definitely a better made game, mm. because it's, like, an improved version mm. of Goldeneye. But people still generally say Goldeneye is better, because it was like, whoa! It's fucking James Bond, it was sick. Yeah, because it was, like, the first of its kind. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, so, you never played it, huh? Nope. Did you ever play Perfect Dark Zero on the 360? I played it for maybe, like, a total of 30 minutes, right? And then you said, fuck that shit. Didn't it come out with the 360? Yeah, dude, the launch yeah. title. My buddy, uh, one of my best friends in high school, his dad was working, uh, well, whatever. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and they got an Xbox early on. <laughs> he was working for Microsoft at the time. Yeah. That's what I was gonna say, whatever. Uh, and they got an Xbox. 360. And, yeah, right when it came out, and we played Perfect Dark Zero. And, and that's all. Yeah, but we played, like, barely any. Mm, okay. Yep. That, that game gets a bad rap. I mean, because people are like, oh, Perfect Dark is one of the greatest shooters of all time, then Perfect Dark Zero, it's like a prequel game, and they're like, it's not as revolutionary, the story sucks ass, mm. the online is kind of fun, but aside from that, it's horrible. Mm. Uh, but anyways, I digress. One last one. Mm-hmm. Shooter of on honorable mention, Halo 3. Ah. I love Halo 3. Very nice, dude. I said, very nice, dude. <laughs> In case you didn't hear me. I said, very nice, dude. Um, thank dentist. you, Elliot. You're so kind. Got him! I swear to God, if you say dentist again, I'm gonna... Dentist? Um, so, um... <laughs> Get chill out. What about you? So, um... Can yeah. you name five shooter games? Um, You're not as into shooters, yeah? No, I'm not as, as into shooters. However, um, yeah, no, Halo 3, mm. I, uh, so I was never a huge Halo fan. That being yep. said, when Halo 3 was, uh, once before it was coming out, like, the days leading up to it, like, all my friends were like, oh my god, it's gonna be amazing! Ah! Hype. They were, like, fangasming all over the place, so <laughs> I couldn't help but get a little excited with them. Yeah. And, uh, my mother, so she, uh, she managed to get me the legendary edition Ooh. of Halo 3, you know, that comes with the Master yeah. Chief helmet and all that. Damn. Even though I'm not even the biggest yeah. fan of it. So. That's cool. Um, yeah, I'm not either, but I was just like, ooh. 
They um, came when Halo Three came out. They had like fucking special. Uh, there was a drink. Mountain Dew. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. They had like a Halo version of Mountain Dew. I think. Yeah. My buddy D has, like, he still has some unopened. D, huh? Yeah. Hmm. This is not a D's nuts joke. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. Well, he he still has one unopened. He did last I was at his house, but then he moved. I still talk to him, but I'll ask him. I'm oh, curious. Oh. Maybe you can edit in yes or no post processing if he still has them. Okay. I'll ask him for a picture of them. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. That'd be fun. I'm Are you gonna ask him, him right now? Yeah, I'm gonna text him right now if that's okay with you. Yeah, thank you, buddy. Cool. Um, I guess that that's um fine because I I could talk about shooters a little. So yeah, I've never been a big fan of shooters. Uh, I guess I I enjoyed Halo Three back in the day, back in 2007, because I had such a fun time playing it with my friends in high school. Like, getting to play on the giant desert desert map and, you know, riding the brute chopper machine and, uh, you know, the, it, using the big, uh, what's it called? The hammer? What was the hammer called? Uh, the gravity hammer? Yeah, the gravity hammer was fun. Getting to play baseball <laughs> yeah. with rocket launchers and the gravity hammer, that was fun. <laughs> um, I really liked drift ball. Oh, yeah. Did you ever play that? I don't know if I, maybe I did, but I know that's based on Red versus Blue. That's all I know. Oh, is it? Yeah, because Griff is one of the main characters. Oh, Griff! I, I fucking hate you, Griff. I didn't understand the reference. Now this now, if we're done coming up with imaginary creatures, tell me this: what creature has tusks? Tusks, just like the wheels here. A walrus. Didn't I just tell you to stop coming up with imaginary creatures? Just had to get that out of my system. <laughs> I love that show. Anyways. That was a really popular show for a yeah, while. Yeah, dude. Red vs. Blue was the shit. Yeah. Um, what's your name? Hong Kong! Name. Hong Kong! Name. Hong Kong! Wait, didn't you consider maybe his name is Hong Kong? Wait a minute. I can speak alien! <laughs> oh, I understand. <laughs> I, I could quote that show for hours, so I'll restrain myself. Um, anyways, oh, you, cool. you, you texted your friend? Yep. Um, so... I was like, hey, dude, this is... Uh, weird question. Do you still have those Halo 3 sodas? Oh, okay. Next time on uh, Royal Goobs, uh, James talks about oh, well. other shooters he played. Bye-bye. Uh, and for a penny and for a pound, I suppose. Bye-bye.